Hi there! Um, so this is Smody Moat. This is my second box opening video. Actually, I think it's my third, but I don't think I posted the other first one way back when. Um, so I ordered a Lutz Tiny Delph Unicorn Centaur um, a little bit ago. Uh, I forget the exact date, but to be honest, this is probably the fastest doll I've ever had shipped. I usually order from Fairyland. Um, they're probably easily my favorite company. But I saw these tiny little centaurs and I just had to have it. So here's the box. It's much smaller than the last box I received. Um, I'm going to apologize right now. I'm using my Mac camera and because the light keeps shifting outside, the, uh, the camera levels keep changing. Alrighty, so um, if I remember correctly, I got the Tiny Delph Peter in, I think, real skin brown. Or no, I got the body in real skin brown, the centaur body, and the Peter body in um, like a light just tan skin. There were so many options. It was so amazing. Um, there, all the centaurs are starting to come in, so definitely check the forums if you would like to see. So here is the inside of the box. Um, got a little wig with him. This is the first time I've basically nearly ordered a full set as well. Uh, I don't usually do that. I don't usually care for the clothes or anything like that, so I don't usually get full sets. The only thing I didn't get was a face-up. Um, Here's his little crown. Oh my gosh, all this stuff is so cute. All right. And then this is, wow, this is a beautiful little card. It's like credit card material. I mean, this isn't going anywhere. And on one side, it's going to be backwards. I'm sorry. It says Lutz. And then on the back, it says Certificate of Ownership. It gives a number. And then it says doll type Tiny Delph Peter Unicorn Centaur Limited. So uh, if you're looking to buy one of these, I'd ask for this card. Because um, we all know that I'm very anti-recast. Oh no, I brought that up in a video. Uh, here's his outfit. I got the Paprika Sash, but I asked for him to come with not the eyes that they sent him with, with a specific gold color, but actually with his green eyes from the wig set. I don't know what this is. I can get it open. Oh! I also ordered a restringer because I've been doing a lot of restringing and the M-Line Fairyland doll that I have is a pain in the butt to restring, let me tell you. And then also I have heel feet from my A-Line girl. And those are a pain in the butt to get on, too. So I figured having this... Oh, and I also have... Oh, I didn't get the restrainer. I got an eye beveler. Because I'm going to open one of my sleeping doll's eyes. So that should be fun. Alright. I do need to get a restrainer, though. That is, that is definitely something I need. Alright, here we go. Here we go. I'm so excited about this cutie. So much tape. I feel like I'm glad that there's this much tape, but at the same time, this is a lot of tape. Alright. Oh, heavens. More tape. Alright. So originally when I had saw them, I had thought about hybriding one of these dolls with a Fairyland doll to Fairyland Pookie Feet, because they're the same, about the same size. But I, I don't know, Peter was pretty cute, so we'll, we'll see what happens here. Oh, I didn't, I didn't share the box. Uh, this is the case for the box. It's got a nice little logo on the side. It's very shiny on the front. Um, little pillow on top little postcard and uh mmm resin 
All right. Dropping things. Good things, everything's so well bubble, bubble wrapped. All right, so here's his tail. Um, I believe I got the gold parts. I'd have to double check and confirm. Um, I like the orange parts too, it was a toss up, but I think the orange parts were a little too bright for me and I like that the gold parts looked a little more like blonde. Ah, oh, cutie teeny hands! I got him the tiny little fist hands because I like extra parts and so if I'm given an option to buy extra hands, I buy extra hands. Bubble Wrap Centaur! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Alright. So, um, other than the Soul Doll Bonnie head that I had come in a little while ago, which I didn't really do an opening for because she was just a head, um, this is the first non-Fairyland doll I've had in a very, very long time. Oh, they sent him with the gold eyes, so oh, well. I will just have to give him new eyes. All right. Wow, what a cutie. Does he have extra parts somewhere? Oh, it's like where are his horn and, and little back fluff? Back fluff. Tail. Oh my gosh, how adorable. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. I love, oh my god, I'm in love with this body. How freaking adorable. Oh my gosh. That is too cute. His head poses really smoothly. Like, there's no clicking. It's, oh my god. Wow. Oh, he's so cute. Um, can I put him? Can I put him here for a second? My computer's very slippery, though. I'm not sure if this will work. Oh, good. Oop. Nope. I knocked him over. That was not him. That was me. So many little tiny limbs. I don't know if y'all can see him. No, it's just his head. All right. Um, so you can. I'll stay here and and get him dressed. Y'all wanna? Y'all wanna watch? I have. I have. No, I'm on my bed, so I have no good surface to let him balance on. Um, that'll work. All right. Okay, let's see if I remember how any of this goes on. I think. Oop. My very unstable bed. I think this goes here. So much glitter and glam. And I, think that, I don't know if this goes over his tail or under his tail. Ah. 
I will figure this out. That goes like that. It's a lot going on here. I need the I need the reference photo. <laughs> I feel like this saddle part is supposed to lay flatter, but it will probably lay flatter in time. Maybe? I have no clue if I'm doing the trick. I feel like I don't understand what's going on with the saddle thing, so we're going to wait on that until I have a photo. Uh, oh, I think it's off. Alright. It's like useful that you can pop his tail on and off, but in the same vein of every other DJD, it's weird that you can take certain parts of their body apart. Alright. Oh, what is this? Oh, I don't know what this is. I got some strings. I'm not sure what the strings are for. That's basically my life though. Oh, does it come with a little necklace? It's adorable. I think it's a little necklace. Whatever they used for this ribbon is really nice. Um, does this go on his arm, I think? But not least, oh my gosh, it comes with little leaves on it. I didn't even notice that. Huh. I feel like they put one of these on the wrong side. That is easy to fix. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's on the right side. Man, you can have really tiny fingers for some of this doll stuff. I have tiny fingers, but they're also kind of pudgy, so that does not work out too well usually. And... oh! Wigging crown. So I always hate buying wigs for tiny dolls, so we'll see if I like this one or not, because I'm looking for a wig for my other girl, and I have yet to find one because everything I buy just turns out looking really awkward.
Fairyland, like, stop selling wigs for their dolls. I mean, like, they do, but they don't. bad. Little poofy. I don't really care for poofy wigs on my dolls. And, oh, crown. He's balancing precariously on my knees. Well, the box is resting on my knees, but I'm sure you can see that. There's so much stuff on my bed right now. My cat's going to be so mad because she's not going to be able to touch any of it. Considering the make of everything else, I kind of hope that the flower crown would be a little better made. It's very, very plasticky. And I'd like it to, like, sit on his head, but that might not be achievable. Eh, sort of. We'll see. Okay, so here he is. Look at my cute little tail! So I will take some pictures later. Um, this is actually quite a nice surprise. I wasn't feeling too great yesterday. I was hoping he'd come in today, but I assumed that he wouldn't come until like 5 o'clock. It's 10.30 in the morning right now, so I actually have daylight to play with him a little bit. I don't have class till 2.15. Um, but yeah, no, that was my, my big thing, was that I don't get home till like 5 o'clock usually, and then I leave right away for work again. So, I was just like, oh, if he comes today, I won't be able to take a good photo of him. But now I can. I haven't named him yet. He has no name. I'm not sure what I want to name him. I have to fix his eyes. They're just sitting way too low on that face. So, I'm very fussy about eyes. So, alright, well, thank you for watching my box opening and awkward putting on of clothing for this little boy. And uh, I will see you the next time that I do a box opening, which probably won't be that far from now. I have a um, mini fee order. Um, I'm getting a body for Charlie because she, I sold her body to go in with the event and get her another body. Um, but that way I could get the event head. And so, uh, hopefully she'll be coming home November, or no, probably not this month. Maybe late December, early January. And, uh, so Charlie will have a, will have a body. And there will be, uh, lots of lesbians on my blog at that point. Because Charlie and Yvette are dating. And that's cute. And then I have my little um, Soldal Mini Fee Hybrid, which she may stay, but I'm also getting the event head and white skin, so we'll see whose head I like more. I may keep both, um, then I just have to buy another body, which is always... <sighs> I really take so much of my money, but there also is the new Kid Delph Centaur that um, they did the Bori Centaur, but this time they're doing like little deer ones and they're so cute. I'm really actually hoping that they put out a deer 
YoSD size doll because I really like these bodies. These centaur bodies are really nice. Um, after my less than stellar experience with the um, Zoom body that I purchased secondhand, um, I really kind of hope that Lutz is planning to do a YoSD because that that would make my day. Um, I hope they don't do it though too soon because I'm very poor right now. Um, a lot of money has gone to dolls, <laughs> and that needs to stop for a while. I have I have school I gotta pay for, and that's not happening. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, there's that. You know my plans now. So, I will see y'all later. Bye bye.